guys, Richard here from Eurovision Island, and once again we're joined by Victor Crone. How are you? Hey guys, uh, I'm very good. I'm, uh, I went off the stage uh, like well, was a couple of hours ago, but my adrenaline is starting to come down a bit. So, uh, yes, I'm very good. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Now, last time we spoke, we were at the London Eurovision party. How did the evening go for you then? Uh, I think it was like the venue was awesome, like such a cool place, and. Uh, that was the first, like the first time I, I sang my song outside of Estonia, and uh, well, I got a bit, I must say, like uh, surprised because yeah, the guys in the crowd actually knew the words to the song, so that was a, a really cool experience. Uh, I had a lot of fun. I hope. Did you? Oh yes, we had great fun. And I think you'll find that the London Eurovision part and the artists that come will find the same feeling. The uh, crowd will sing along. Yeah, it's yeah, it's crazy. Like, uh, and I, 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 the same in Spain as well. Like, it's uh, it's a very fun place to be singing at. So skip forward a few weeks. Yeah. Now you're in Tel Aviv. How yeah. has your experience being in Tel Aviv and everything else? I can't say that I've seen so much because we flew in last night, or like late. We came here like one in the morning, mm. so it was like straight to bed. And uh, yeah, woke up in this uh, beautiful hotel. I got a great view. I see the beach and everything, so that's awesome. Uh, bragging a bit, just a bit, kind of bit. Uh, but uh, hopefully, I will see more um, this time. I, I've seen. I, re I shoot the postcard, you know, yeah. a month ago maybe, even more. So I've seen like small pieces. But, uh, I know we're going to Jerusalem tomorrow. A lot of gibberish here, yeah, no, I just talked about it. But uh, I'm going to Jerusalem tomorrow. Well, we're hoping to do the same thing next Wednesday. So, oh, yeah? Yes, we, oh. we are hoping. Oh. oh, you don't know with all the interviews? No, uh, no we'll make us like, a little team outing. Te team out? Team Time outing out. for the website. Oh, okay, okay. So, so um, we know we've asked this question before, but have you actually found a cake you like yet? <laughs> <laughs> Well, I haven't had any since I talked to you guys, so, uh, well, you have to bring some. You should have a tasting like, with all the artists, like strawberry cake and everything. Which, yeah. We'll, we'll talk to the delegation about it, see what we can arrange. Yeah, you're very unhappy about this, right? No, it's <laughs> fine, no, it's fine, because we've had other artists say similar things. So oh, okay, fine. okay. Yeah, well, actually, cake is a bit of a Swedish thing, because we have the word, you probably heard Fika, and you always have the... <laughs> And in, Tired of it. <laughs> and, and, in, and in <laughs> Stockholm, when we're at Eurovision 2016, we had what was known as Fika O'Clock because at four o'clock they used to bring Fika to us. Oh, okay. Oh, so it's worldwide. Oh yes, Fika. it's well known within the Eurovision community. So, oh, okay. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. So we know you're a very busy boy, and there's other people waiting to speak to you. So thank you very much. Thanks for yeah. Good to see you again. Thanks. Thank you. Okay.